Hey guys, what's up, and welcome back to another Fallout 3 pretty much let's play series. Why well, I say pretty much is because I don't name it that, but that's pretty much what it is. Um, anyways, uh, we're just gonna keep eluding things, and I actually probably have to travel back again to Megaton just to sell some things, and it's well worth it just because you make good money. But, um, and after that, we're gonna continue on, so sorry about that. I didn't want to do that off camera just because, in case anyone was following this. But that's what I'm going to do right now. Just loot. And then sell. Before I go on. Because then afterwards. You really have no points. You really have uh, no time to go back and sell. You just get all this shit. And all this stuff that you pick up now. Is useless. I mean you can, I guess you could always come back. And sell this stuff. I mean not sell it. But always come back and loot this stuff. But. I'm going to do it before so we don't have to make multiple trips back here later. So what I'm doing now is actually worth it. Gun cabinet. Awesome. Finally got my assault rifle back. Awesome. Very nice stuff to loot. Um, open the old box. What do we got? Come at night. Take it both. Anything else we can take real fast. Alright. Oh wow, we can actually hack this, and it's not bad. Alright, so hopefully <coughs> I can do this fast. Nice. Um, Alright, that's fine. It could be this one as well. Alright, that gives us more of a variety now. Can't be that one. Can't be that one. Just gonna continue to see if I can find anything else, like another dud. Oh, there we go. Oh, it removed the one I already used. Thank you for that. Uh, gonna be this. Let me find out. Nope. Codes. Nope. What do we got here? Panel. Nope. Uh, what about this? Love. Nope. Uh, hates, maybe? Absolutely not. Maybe this one, let me see. No, can't be that one. Not much left, so we're just not even gonna look for duds. There it is, hands. I don't know what I never I don't think I've ever hacked this before, so I have no idea what what this could behold. Latest reports. Uh, I guess it's just information. Alright, is there anything else that's important? Nothing. That was a waste. Anyways, let's go ahead and uh, see if there's anything else to loot real fast. Maybe something all the way back here. So I know it seems like it's kind of a waste of time right now, but trust me, you're going to need all the money that you can get to buy ammunition shit like that. Once you get money, you really, it, it's just a lot easier in this game. You don't have to worry about anything. I cannot get over there from this side. Let's go ahead and see what else we can get real fast. Ooh, we're almost to the cap. That's actually going to be the cap. Unless there's things we can repair. We are full, purified water. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, get rid of some of this stuff. Just like that, and we're good. And I don't think there's anything else over here, so, oh, another scrap metal, we can take that. And nothing else that we can hold. Anyways, we're gonna head back to Megaton Celt and then start on this quest. I know it's gonna, it seems like. We've been just traveling back and forth, but we've just been looting, and that's a main, a main, main part 
in this game at the beginning. Once you are like higher along in this game, like a higher level, you got all the money, um, you don't need to loot pretty much, you really don't need to loot anything. I mean, you pretty much have everything set. So it's really, it's really only important for the beginning levels to loot like pretty much everything you can just because you don't really have much money and you really need money. Money is the key in this game. So is ammunition and your skill points and stuff like that. There's, but money will help you out just like it would in real life and pretty much any other game that has a currency. Anyways, let's go see who has something for sale. We're not going to go to Mora. We're going to go to Duck. I'm sure he has some health supplies I can have. Can I? Oh, this is something fun to do as well. If you ever bored, just go to this guy. And I think it's it's A. Yeah, A or X, depending uh what system you're on. You can just push him down. Pretty much cow tip. Poor, poor thing. Oh well. Anyways, where are you at, Doc? Hello. The Christ say. What do you have for sale? Oh, why the hell did I do that? Um, where the hell? I need to buy some medical supplies. There it is. He barely has. Okay, at least he has a lot of stim packs. I'm not gonna get all those. Obviously, I'm just just said I would, but I obviously won't buy all those. I just have a lot of shit, so I was like, you know what? Why not? It would be amazing if I could sell him all the shit and still have. Wow, this actually will be pretty close. I think I have a stealth boy I can sell him. That's what I do. I sell my stealth boys. I think I went over that already. Yeah, I did. But I'm not gonna. I don't have any stealth boys to sell them. What do we have here? Breast knuckles. Take that. Combat knife. Take that. We don't need a baseball bat anymore. We have all this shit. And now let's give him back some stim packs because obviously we don't need. You know what? Hell. We'll keep all these stim packs. You done? All right. So there we go. That was pretty fast. Oh, one more thing. Let's go to Walter and. Give him the scrap metal. We have 15 of them. That's going to be some nice experience and nice caps. It's going to be 150 caps in our pockets. Plus, how much experience does it give you per? I think it gives you maybe five experience per scrap metal. Am I, am I right? I don't know. We'll find out in a second. If that's true. We'll have 75 experience. Well, all right. Oh, yeah, sweet. It is true. Caps. All right. I have to go, and now we can start on the quest. <laughs> so, I keep saying that, like, oh, when we come back, we're gonna do this quest. When we come back, we're gonna get to this quest and do it. But yeah, now I actually mean it. We're going to start on it. There's nothing else we need to loot. There's no other reason to go back to Megaton now. We're just going to do the quest. After the quest, we'll well, we'll pretty much get the best armor in the game, which is gonna be set. And then after that, we might. I'm not sure what I say. Might we might do the wasteland survival guide then do all the other dlcs or we might do the all the other dlcs and then the wasteland survival guide like, like i said the wasteland survival guide is kind of like the beginning of a nice beginning quest so i mean the farther you push it behind this it's gonna be so much easier to do but also like the rewards you get for pushing it behind just because you're the higher level you get more of a reward is nice but it's also nice at the beginning just because she helps you out a lot. And is this a glitch? I think we are glitched. <laughs> no way. Oh no, of course. No, go back down. Go back down. Okay, I'm sorry about that, guys. It, w it was a glitch. Like the door wouldn't open, nothing was going on. Anyways, we're just going to ride the elevator back down. Sometimes this game can be glitchy like that. I'm, that's a first for me though. I played through this game about four, five times already, maybe. Well, sometimes I haven't completed. I only completed like two times, but I've played through it many times, and I've never, uh, never experienced that glitch. My dogs are barking. I'll edit that out as well. Probably someone just got home. Anyways, let's go. You have anything? Nope. Let's just go straight to the to the person. We don't need to talk to anyone. Definitely not you. 
Hello. Oh, and is this who we're... Oh, we're supposed to talk to him. Come on, let's move it. I ain't got all day. Are you kidding me? Listen, chump. You're here because McGraw says we need you. You're not here to make small talk. You're sure as hell not here to get anything out of me, so quit trying. You know what you need to know. Don't push your luck. I got loads of problems, chump. You don't want to become one, so shut up and get in the... the simulator thing there. Move it! <laughs> that guy's not very nice. <laughs>